University of Maryland Hospital is receiving help from the highest government office in Maryland. Way up there, not the governor, no. but First Lady. How about you, me, Hogan? As ABC 2's Don Harrison tells us, the First Lady saw what her husband went through, of course, during his cancer treatments, and now he wants to help pediatric cancer patients at the University of Maryland Hospital. That's Josh Birch receiving a doctor's white coat today because he has expressed his interest in becoming a doctor. Josh's medical experience is from the other side, though. He is undergoing treatments for non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Cancer treatments are overwhelming enough for adults, let alone young patients. That's why Maryland's first lady, Yumi Hogan, started a pediatric art program funded by the Yumi Cares Foundation. Resident artist Marty Weishire works with pediatric cancer patients to involve art in their healing process. Doing artwork gives the patient an outlet to express themselves and take their minds off their treatments. Kids have to be activity, mm -hmm. not sitting on bed. So how we get up from there, out from bed, then they have a meet with another friend. So same situation, pediatric patients, they talk together, play together, moment they forgot about that they have their patient. So that's what we try to do. So they have a share, they can have a more, stay strong. Not all insurers will cover a program like this, but since the First Lady's Foundation is paying for this, there will be no charge to the patient. Yeah, I was talking with Josh, this young cancer patient who's going through the same cancer treatment as me, and he said he's, he's really been able to express himself. And, and, and Governor Hogan was here out. to support his wife's program. My wife has been um, going to hospitals around the state herself and helping to teach kids art, and, and she came up with the idea that this would be a, a great idea if we could actually have art therapy. Newly appointed doctor, Josh um, Burke. I went to art therapy, and I, I drew some stuff, and it just kind of got my emotions out, and it just made it a lot easier on me. Made you feel better, right? Yeah. They hope to expand this to all pediatric programs in the hospital. At the University of Maryland Hospital, Don Harrison.